He spoke only to Andraste. Do you believe yourself her equal? I never said that. I... In Orle, you were someone. In Lothering, you feared you would lose yourself, become a drab sister, and disappear. When your brothers and sisters of the Cloister criticized you for what you professed, you were hurt, but you also reveled in it. It made you special. You enjoyed the attention, even if it was negative. You're saying that I made it up for... for the attention? I did not. I know what I believe. And you, Morrigan, Flemeth's daughter, what? Be gone, spirit. I will not play your games. I will respect your wishes. The way is open. Good luck, and may you find what you seek. As you say. Echoes from a shadow realm. Whispers of things yet to come. Thought strange sister dwells in night. Is swept away by dawning light. Of what do I speak? A dream came upon me as my daughter slumbered beneath my heart. It told of her life, and of her betrayal and death. I am sorrow and regret. I am a mother weeping bitter tears for a daughter she could not save. I'd neither a guest nor a trespasser be. In this place I belong. That belongs also to me. Of what do I speak? It was my dream for the people to have a home of their own, where we would have no masters but ourselves. The enemy of my enemy is my friend, and thus we followed Andraste against the Imperium. But she was betrayed, and so were we. A poison of the soul, passion's cruel counterpart. From love she grows, till love lies slain. Of what do I speak? Yes, jealousy drove me to betrayal. I was the greatest general of the Alamoni, but beside her I was nothing. Hundreds fell before her on bended knee. They loved her, as did the Maker. I loved her too. But what man can compare with a god? She wields the broken sword and separates true kings from tyrants. Of what do I speak? Yes, I could not bear the sight of Andraste's suffering, and mercy bade me end her life. I am the penitent sinner, who shows compassion as he hopes compassion will be shown to him. No man has seen it, but all men know it. Lighter than air, sharper than any sword, comes from nothing but will fell the strongest armies. Of what do I speak? Yes, hunger was the weapon used against the wicked men of the Teventer Imperium. The Maker kindled the sun's flame, scorching the land. Their crops failed, and their armies could not march. Then he opened the heavens and bade the waters flow, and washed away their filth. I am Kefer, disciple of Andraste and commander of her armies. I saw these things done and knew the Makers smiled on us. The bones of the world stretched towards the sky's embrace, veiled in white, like a bride greeting her groom. 
Of what do I speak? Yes. I carried Andraste's ashes out of Tevinter into the mountains to the east, where she could gaze ever into her maker's sky. No more fitting a tomb than this could we find. An eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth. The debt of blood must be paid in full. Of what do I speak? Yes, my husband Hesarian would have chosen a quick death for Andraste. I made him swear that she would die publicly with her war leaders. That all would know the Imperium's strength. I am justice. I am vengeance. Blood can only be repaid in blood. The smallest lark could carry it, while a strong man might not. Of what do I speak? Yes, I was Andraste's dearest friend in childhood, and always we would sing. She celebrated the beauty of life and all who heard her would be filled with joy. They say the Maker himself was moved by Andraste's song, and then she sang no more of simple things. Had fun with the riddle game? But they do speak plainly. Riddles speak to your soul and your gut more often than to your mind. Or they always seem to for me. You have come so far since I saw you last. The last vestiges of your shackled life in the circle have all but fallen away. You are free of the past and nothing will hold you back. Be strong, my friend. Do not falter. I have something for you. Use it well. It makes me happy knowing you will be the mage that I never could. Hey, you see those thingies over on the side of that huge chasm? I bet they're used for something. Maybe I should touch them or stand on them? Asda, normal people tend to avoid strange looking sections of floor thingies, as you say. They tend to be traps. You uh, don't really think they're traps, do you? <laughs> that part of the bridge looks like it's there. But I don't think it is. Try something else. Where to? That's it! That's an actual bridge piece right there. If we can get all the bridge pieces to be solid, we can make it across. Ask 
me anything. Clever, it seems. I... I... I don't know what to say. been through the trials of the gauntlet. You have walked the path of Andraste, and like her, you have been cleansed. You have proven yourself worthy, Pilgrim. Approach the sacred ashes. dreamed I would ever lay my eyes on the urn of sacred ashes. I... I, I... I have no words to express. I didn't think anyone could succeed in finding Andraste's final resting place. But here's, here she is. I stand in awe. Really, 